Yes, I couldn't stay away. It, uh, welcome back to Zero Page Homebrew. Kind of. It's just a little extra video that I thought I would do because I didn't get enough of Galaga. And being the only person in the world with a copy of Galaga for Atari 2600, except for the people who developed it, I believe it's my duty to play more Galaga for you. Um, so welcome back to all the people who uh, can turn in, tune in, turn in, uh, tune in at uh, 9 p.m. Um at night on Pacific time, because it's like, I guess, midnight on the East Coast, so thank you for the late night tune-in, and it's time for more Galaga. Um, yeah, so I like Galaga, and um, I thought it would be time for some more Galaga, and um, Militant Buddhist asks, uh, any idea when this game will be released? Yes, the sync is off, thank you very much. I didn't tweak that, because I'm not doing my usual procedures. And there we go. Thank you, I supposed to. Um, Militant Buddha says, any idea when the game will be released? Uh, John Champeau has two games before this to be released. He said this one's 90 to 95% done. Um, and he has Wizard of War and Avalanche to release first. And he will be releasing a, a demo of this game when he's corrected everything that needs to be corrected and there's not much that needs to be corrected um, unless some hardcore Galaga gamers out there can really dive in and kind of look at what is uh, what could be wrong with the implementation of it um, I am a casual uh, Galaga player I more enjoy it than I am good at it but I do enjoy it, so... But I would like to get better at it. And what better way to get better at it is to play some more. Uh, Militant Buddha says, I have the Galaga Flight School shirt. Excellent. I did look at multiple Galaga shirts. And there's ones with numbers all over it and stuff like that. And I thought this simple one with a basic screen of Galaga um, was the most clean version of it. Where there's a Galaga trying to suck up your ship. This guy's not going for it, even though he has uh, two extra ships to be sucked up. But he's like, nah, nah, I'm going to do it on my own. And I was just looking up high scores for Galaga on Twin Galaxies, and there's a bunch of different categories for arcade high scores. Um, one is points for marathon, and this is like playing as long as you can play, do whatever you like, and the top score is... 17 million points and I believe it rolls at 10 million so you have to keep track of that that was set in 2018 and he beat the next one out that was set in 1989 so a long time then there's tournament settings for points and I believe you can't get more than five men and it is set by the exact same person and he got 9 million points and then there's a rapid fire setting which seems to be harder. Um, maybe it just continually shoots? I'm not sure. Let's see what the rules say on that. Um, usage of this trick to cause enemies to stop firing is banned. Um, position A, rapid fire. Not sure what that is. And then there's a one, uh, no double ship, marathon. That would be difficult. And there's only one entry, 119,590. So I don't think a lot of people go for that record. Um, let's see what else. And, uh, Militant Buddhist said that I, uh, made quite a noise when I saw, uh, that it was Galaga when I turned it on for the first time, uh, playing the game when it was revealed earlier today. A, um, and I supposed to wants to remind us that Satan's Hollow from Champ Games is planned because I supposed to did a proof of concept version of... Satan's Hollow, which was actually really, really, really good and kind of a more than a proof of concept. It had both screens and uh, yeah, it was really, really cool uh, and very like, yes, this is doable. And that's another one of my favorite games. I played the hell out of it on the Commodore 64. But let's, uh, a school friend could play Galaga forever on one credit. Not me. Not me either. I'm not an expert at it. I just like it. But let's get into it because we're here to play. Uh, let me switch over to Galaga. Oh, where's my remote control so I can switch my TV? Not just your view. 
but I have to see it too. There we go. I'll keep this handy for volume. And it's still labeled Champ Secret Project. So I whipped together a, um, a Galaga logo. It's right below me there. And I put Champ Games on the bottom. So. And the ever present Atari Age symbol. Would you like to play a game? And I have to type in my secret code, which I completely remember which one it is. And it's Z80. So all you people who have a copy of this at home can punch in your codes now. No, just kidding. Um, there we go. And the, and the wonderfulness that is Galaga. So we have uh, Standard, Advanced, and Novice. I'm just going to go for Standard right now. And uh, thank you to, obviously, these wonderful people. John Shampo, Nathan Strum, Ross Keenum. Ross Kingdom did the sound a million years ago. I think it was 2012. Um, and Nathan Strum, always present in these amazing games, uh, doing a bang-up job of the graphics, um, given the limitations of what can be shown on the screen. And obviously amazing coding by John Champo, who ported over his DOS uh, routines that he made for uh, Galagon, I think it was called. Because uh, he made this game a long time ago for DOS, so he was able to use portions of it uh, for this game. Oh, it's going to attract mode. Is that too loud? I'm going to turn down just a little bit. There we go. Okay. And it's erased all my high scores, so let's get some more. So I did some... Uh, that's a little loud on this end. little bit of studying of some gameplay so we'll see how well that goes and again I don't purport to be an expert at this game I just purport to uh, like it a lot. and there is a, a bug in this game uh, where your sh captured ship does disappear um, when it goes off the screen, unfortunately. But uh, John is going to fix that. So if I don't shoot the Galaga when it comes down, it'll take my ship off the screen and it won't come back till the next uh, screen. So I have to make sure I shoot it so I can get double shots. Actually comes down right away pretty quick. We'll see. Nope, not yet. There we go. And I missed it. And it's gone. And that is the only big bug that was found during the gameplay. But it does come back, so I didn't really lose my ship. And the game does look fantastic, a tasty sandwich. Oh, it's playing. It's playing. Oh my god. So, the strategy that I saw on the person who was playing the game is that you sit in the corner when the Gallic when Oh, it's not working. <laughs> oh, there's my ship. So I need to shoot that guy once and get rid of his... There we go. So now he's all primed. Now I have to shoot him again right away when he comes down. Or I will lose my ship and have to wait for the next round. The next round is a challenge mode. And that is when I want my double ship. For sure. There we go. There. Oh, oh, good. Yeah, this game looks stupid good. It does. Like when the when the uh, enemies are in formation, the, the graphics are scrunched just a little bit, but it retains the perfect uh, look of it. No, 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 no! Arg. Arg. Oh no, another one went by. Not so great. 35 out of 40. But we're going to practice. And not get hit. Too much with the bullets coming down at me. 
I think this is this challenge is just a bit below arcade because I was watching some arcade um, footage and they do seem to go a little faster in the arcade. Oh, got an extra life. That is handy. They seem to just loop a little faster and shoot a little more bullets than this one. But I will do some more studying. Oop, one more guy. There we go. And the pressure is off too when I'm playing now. Because John's not watching. <laughs> or maybe he is secretly. And I feel it's my duty to... Well, one of the things they, um... Oh, God, seriously. Okay, well, I'll get captured again. Oh, that was just gonna turn. Damn it. One of the things they said, don't sit in the corner. Stay in the middle is a better... Do, 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 do. Sitting in the corner is bad because you get trapped in it. So I'm gonna try and not... I think I just barely avoided that bullet. What is this nonsense I see, Lord Monka says? This is Galaga for Atari 2600, made by Champ Games. The uh, amazing people at Champ Games have done it again. Okay, I've cleared the board. I think I have to... There we go! Got double ships back! First challenging does seem harder than the arcade. Uh, does it? It seems a little harder, doesn't it? Oh my god! That didn't last long. I need to at least make it to the second challenging stage, but I do have a number of lives, so... Oh, but I want to get my double ship back. Should I risk it? And I just need to clear this board a bit. This is a mess. Come on, get, get rid of some of these guards that are... Oh, they've all got guards! Ugh. Messy, messy, messy board. Okay. Oh. No, 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 no. Come on. Yep. Oh. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I remember reading about this thread not being possible, and John comes along and, and says, Hold my beer. Yes, I was reading that thread um, a long time ago when I got into the Atari Age forums. Ah, I missed it. Oh, it came back! That's weird! Okay, so the bug is a little weird. I got it. <sighs> Just in time. So if it's accompanying a um, another enemy, it looks like your ship stays. But when it's just the Galaga by itself, your ship goes away. Okay, time, just in time for stage seven. No, 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 damn it. one it's usually I, mean, I play the challenging stage and I always get it like I usually get 40 every single time on the first challenging stage with two ships and this seems a little bit harder maybe I play the NES version a lot so I don't play I do play the arcade a little bit but maybe I need to practice in the arcade some more and don't lose the second ship immediately Start destroying things. See, I'm... See, that's the problem. I'm moving around the middle. Where I should start in the middle, or start in the side, attract the bullets. I mean, it doesn't count anymore. Oh, I shot him too early. He was going to turn into some other creatures. Oh, am I in a good position for being sucked up? Yes, I am! Yeah, when I read that thread, I was super disappointed that people were saying, no, Galaga's not possible for the 2600. Because I thought, mm, maybe it could be. Maybe it could be possible. Okay, here we go. In my ship. Yes! Come on down. Stage 9. Don't get hit. So start in the side. Okay, well, I was on the wrong side, but we start on this side, then move over. Start in the corner, move over. Nope. It's not 
tactic's not working or I'm not doing it very well. What am I doing? I'm not even paying attention to where my ship is. And I've lost them all because I went for double shots. But level 9, way better than I did on the show earlier. Even though I didn't break 50, that's weird. It's all about what you do. Zero. Page. Homebrew. Oh, you can go back and forth or press the button. Nice. Okay, let's do this again. Okay, let's do this. Now they don't bomb or shoot in the first level. And I read that it doesn't matter how many guys you have left. So I always thought they had to you had to leave a certain number of enemies to get sucked up with the ship. And I think you just need to leave two of these Galagas. And only one one goes by, and then you get sucked up in the second one. There's no rules. I was trying to find some rules online about when you can or can't get sucked up. He's using real estate really well, because that top of the ship is cut off. Like, it's gone. But you don't need to see it. You only need to see the top of your... Okay. okay, it should come back if I let it go. Nope. <laughs> okay. Only if there's other creatures around, I guess. Oh. So my theory's going out the window for that one. It's random, so that's something he ne uh, John needs to look into. There we go. Just have to get my ship back on stage two. And shoot everything. Because the bullets do go for you. Let's see, no, I'm waiting too long in the corner. What you should do is start in the corner, and as soon as they come out, break away from them. That's what I think I'm doing wrong. I'm staying too long in the corner. I need to get rid of those guys on the bottom. There. And shoot the guy once. Oh, got him once. I need to get him. Yes! Just in time for challenging stage. I thought I'd hop on the stream because I thought it was my duty as the only person in the world who has this game to show some more of the game. Yes, there we go. This is hard because you have to shoot these guys twice. Ah! This is harder than the arcade, this challenging stage for sure. Ah! It does help if I position myself correctly. There, I missed three? 37? 37, yep. Yeah. Oh, and the music's got that, that reverby to it. It's so good. So stay in the corner and then move out? No. I think that only works in the higher levels. Damn it! Arrgh! Hate it. I think I'm just gonna stick with my strategy for now of just avoiding bullets at all costs. I do have an extra guy, so I will get captured again. Oh, come on. Give me that tractor beam. Oh! Oh! Scorpions! Can't do anything about them. They went away. So, my history with Galaga is, come on, come on, there we go. Um, there's a ferry that goes across from Vancouver to Vancouver Island, and there was an arcade in the ferry, and they had Galaga. Oh, this is not challenging stage, I better pay attention. Um, they had a ferry in, uh, they had an arcade in the uh, ferry, and Galaga, of course, was one of the games in there. Along with Marble Madness as well. And, and Galaga was a pretty, pretty big mainstay in most places that are, had arcades or um, like corner stores that had a machine. There's always Galaga because it was a moneymaker. It's such a popular game. 
Hooray! Um, so I, I played it a lot as a kid. Um, in, in the arcade. Um, I didn't, I didn't get a lot of money to spend on arcade games, so I would play it once in a while, but if I had a choice, I would play Galaga, because it would probably last me longer than, um, some other games where I would die instantly. Um, I could go, you know, at least maybe five minutes or something. <laughs> or maybe ten minutes, depending on the game, how, how well I did. Um, but then I got a Commodore 64. How say? Oh, come on! Come on! Oh, I missed one. Oh. I do need to learn the patterns. It would help. Um... But then I got a Commodore 64, and I'm like, yes, all right, I can get a, a version of Galaga for the C64, because it would seem like it's a system that would be easily be made. To, uh, Galaga could be easily made on it. It's a very capable machine of very advanced games. Uh, but there was never an official port of Galaga for the Commodore 64. Um, there were some terrible ports, and the only one I ever got was a kind of a text-based Galaga, where everything was blocks. It, it was such a weird port. It kind of worked okay, but, I mean, it was super chunky looking. Um, like, the patterns seemed okay. Like, the patterns of the, the flying enemies seemed to, to be doing okay, but, um... Oh, God. Ah, oh, nuts. Um, and it was fun enough. But it was not Galaga. It wasn't even col in color. It was like one color. And it was like green color. It was terrible. Um, so I was fairly disappointed not having a Galaga to play on. And I don't remember anybody having Galaga for the NES. Uh, any of my friends, because I never had any consoles growing up. Um, not till I was like in my 20s and starting to buy them at uh, flea markets. Uh, oh my god, that's good. Okay, I do have an extra ship. Yes, I will do that. Yeah, the Miss Pac-Man Galaga combo was very common as well. Lord Monka says that is very true. Um, and that would be the one uh, arcade cabinet I would buy if I had tons of room, which I don't. Ah, oh, and it's gone. And it's gone till the next level. Hi. Hi, Atari. Don't scratch the couch, please. Oh, God. I did better. Level 9, not better level, but uh, I think I made it to 9 last time. But I got 58,000, which is a lot better. Got a Miss Ca Pac-Man cabinet also, you Milton Buddhist one says. Um, I don't have room for a cabinet, unfortunately. I would get one. I'd probably get that combo. Oh, came in first! Zero page homebrew. Let's get to level 10. Let's do it. I have it for NES, it's it's solid. Yeah, the NES version of Galaga is pretty good. Let me find it here. If I can, quickly. Nope, that's Gyrus. There it is. If I can get it out without destroying my stack of games. Here we go. Um, was it Galaga Demons of Death? It had like a subtitle to it, Galaga Demons of Death, as if Galaga wasn't enough of a seller. They thought, oh, we'd have to, we have to put Demons of Death on it. That'll sell more copies. What the hell just fell? Oh. Roll control. Okay, let's do it. Oh, you get more points for shooting the Galaga in formation, but just the Galaga. See, I don't know the points. I just like playing. Somebody called me out in the forum saying, Oh, it was embarrassing watching you play. You don't know how to play. It's like, And he said, for somebody who uh, says that they love Galaga as their favorite game. Well, you can like a game, but not be an expert at it. You can like just playing it. So it's not... 
It's not it doesn't mean that you're an expert at it just because you like playing it. It's just fun. It's a fun game. But maybe I'll become an expert after um, playing it so much on the Tar 2600. Seems like a funny concept that you know I would get better at Galaga from a port on one of the probably the most basic machines you could port it to. Is, was there a more basic machine that it's ever been ported to? I think this is like the most the oldest machine it's been ever been ported to. So I, I don't think it would do very well on a, a machine that has lesser capabilities. I mean, it's definitely the oldest. Like, I don't think it, uh, Galaga was ever put on like in television. But that's oh, bye bye. Let's not die. There we go. Uh, or Coleco? Was it ever put on Coleco? I don't think it was. I mean, Coleco Vision. Coleco's a company. Um, I don't think so. Can somebody look that up and see if Galaga was ever uh, ported? Like back in the day, or somebody made a, a fan version of it? It seems like Coleco would be able to handle it. There's my ship. Give me back my ship. Good. Cleared it out. Need to shoot him once. Ooh, got the big points. Just like it showed in the demo. There we go. Now we're ready. I'm just waiting for it to come down. Then I panic, then I'll miss it. Loop. And miss. <laughs> I need another try. Oh, I can't wait for uh, John Shampoo to fix that. <laughs> That is a really, really annoying bug. <laughs> and probably most people wouldn't see that because they'd be able to shoot it. But sometimes there's just too many... Oh, one shot. Most people would be able to shoot it. Only one ship in the challenging stage. Not enough bullets. Oh, got them all there. Oh. Interweb says yes to ColecoVision Galaga. Oh, very nice. Can you um, find a video of that? Or a screenshot of that easily for me so I can just click it and look at it? Please, Militant Buddhist One. So for people that are just tuning in right now, or have tuned in recently. This was just released today. This is Galaga and I shot my ship. Oh, did I get it back? No, I shot my ship and got enough points from shooting myself that I gained, that I went over 20,000 and got a free life. Not really the way I wanted to get a free ship. That's like the wrong way. Uh, I didn't even notice my ship was up there. I totally forgot about it. This is going to make life harder. Harder. Oh, thank you for the video. I'll take a look at that after I finish this game. Come on. Come on. Stop it. There we go. Uh, this was released today by Champ Games. Um, we had a world exclusive on Zero Page Homebrew for... Galaga here. Thank you very much, John Champeau. I am a huge fan of his work and a huge supporter and interviewed him while he was at, while we were both at uh, Portland Retro Gaming Expo uh, this past year, 2018, where he was showing off Wizard of War. Okay, now dive down, take my ship, I'll never get it back. I only get one pass at it. A super game module required. Okay, that makes sense. That super game module is very expensive. But Phoenix is coming, which is built in super game module. Hello. You want to join me? Okay. Um, I will shuffle over at the opportune moment. If you can clear that stuff. Oh, and I lost my ship. It's not your fault. It's really hard to shoot it. Okay. There's probably a good 
good time. Can you take more stuff out of the way? Uh, there we go. I'll shift this over. There we go. How's your game? Um, I'm doing better than when I was playing during the broadcast because now I've more. I've played it more. Not an expert at it, but I'm doing better. Maybe not this game. What's that noise? Did I get another light? No. Maybe. Oh, what should happened? Have. What was that noise? <laughs> Anybody explain that noise to me? Got thirty-two thousand. Maybe it was indicating Scorpius. something. Yeah. Oh, what it was indicating? Was nothing happened. Things were just coming in on the screen. Whoa, that was close. Come on, take my ship, please. You can't be friends with him anymore. He had never played Galaga. <laughs> what? For Erlen? Erlen? Yeah, he didn't even know what Galaga was. Which is fine. <laughs> he is of a different generation. That's true. There we go. Shoot you once. Oh, it got him. Oh, it's way up there. I always lose mine immediately. Because <laughs> it's Me like... Me too. It's a bigger... It's, it's, it's... I swear they're, they're a little wider. I, I, yeah. Well, it makes it's you hard. wider in general. It does. Stage seven. Oh, you're doing really well. Mm, oh, is this the bonus round? Yep. Challenging stage. It is challenging. Nice. Yes. Nice. Come on. Ah. Really close. Very close. Ah. Uh -huh. Not That's super great. Very good. My high score is fifty-eight thousand. So. Getting but there. I have no lives left. I made oh. it to level 9 this time. I don't think I will this time. Uh, Let's see. Oh. And this is the beginning of the end. Uh -huh. <laughs> but I don't have to worry about getting my ship captured. Because I don't have a ship to be captured. Oh. <sighs> Stage 8. That's pretty good. That game transcends. <laughs> what did I get? Oh, it didn't show the score yet. Because there's not enough room for the game and the score at all times. So he's he kind of made a... Oh, that's smart, though. Because yeah. then, yeah. And it actually pushes a cap your captured ship half off the screen. Okay. Which is fine. You don't need to see your ship. It just... Nice. There oh. you go. I don't think I'll be hitting stage. <laughs> stage 9. Stage yeah. 10. You can make it. Does it, the two-player work? Uh, it just alternates. We can do that. Well, I've yeah, it's actually a good idea. There we go. See if I'm better with this, or do you want to play? With no, this? I'll play with this okay. for now. As long as I have the pillow, I was, it's always hard to put this on my lap. I feel like. Oh, pillow might help. Yeah. It's on a Galaga pillow. I know. Maybe. Maybe that'll help. In theory. Um, oh, I was telling the story for people who just tuned in. Yes, this uh, was released upon a zero page today <laughs> um, for everyone to take a look at. It was a world exclusive for zero page. It was very happy to have it. And um, it has been in development for a month and a half. That's all the time he has worked on this, which is unbelievable. But there is a story behind that. He had already made a DOS version called Gal Galago. Yes, you went there. Galago? <laughs> <laughs> um, so he had a lot of um, the code, I'm guessing the code for the movement, already done. And also the sounds were pretty much done in 2012. Oh, you're lucky. So if it goes off the screen, there's a bug in this game. Oh, you were in saying it disappears. It disappears till the next level. So you have to make sure you get it. Galagon, not Galago. Thank you, uh, Milton Buddhist one. Um, so he he had to adapt it to the 2600. But, obviously, there's still a lot of work. Ah! Oh, knew that oh, was going to oh. happen. Well, you survived. Good explosion. i got to watch that explosion know, next it's time. Cute, it's, it's, it's it looks it's like very cool. accurate to the original explosion. But I guess he could use two sprites um, wide for that explosion and get a lot of resolution out of it. I think you know 
I think you need to know where to be on challenging stage and hold the button down. That is true. No, 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 oh, no, no, oh he's do? stuck. Why no, is he stuck? He's going to shoot you now. Why? And you have to kill him. Aw, is or, that normal? Oh, is that oh a, he left. He left. Does he? Is that a bug too? Or is that how it works in the arcade? I don't, I, know. I don't usually have that happen. <laughs> Where you, you get your guy to turn on you. <laughs> Yeah, you have to shoot the guy that's... It's whole... Uh, you have to shoot the Galaga, but only in motion. Not when he's up there. Oh, good job. You don't need that second ship. <laughs> that is so mean. Ah! <sighs> the mother bug has to be attacking to capture. Oh, I see. I, yeah. I, for some reason, I totally thought that, uh... You just had to frame? That's not how it, how it... Ah, oh, right into me. beeline. I and my you? ships are different Oh, colors. it's your turn. <laughs> oh, I hate this fire button. Oh, no. This is going to be terrible. No, you're doing I'm gonna, pretty good. Well, I'm going to hold the fire button down, because this will wreck my hand. Oh, I see. Just hold it. Yeah. Can you hold it? Yeah, yeah, it goes rapid fire. Well, that's good at least. Yeah. So it won't be too bad, but it will mess up my game a little bit. My strategy. Come on down. Ah. Come on. Take my ship. <gasps> no, you're, in, you're invincible once... Once you're sucked in, Once right? you're sucked in, yes. Yeah. You can shoot... But you might shoot the guy that's capturing you. Which is uh, not good if you want to be captured. It is good if you don't want to be captured. That is risky. <laughs> Shooting it yeah. like that, because it's it's moving, so if you're shot... Oh. oh, I wasn't watching the bullets. I was watching the guy. Damn it. Oh. Well, that didn't last that was very long. <laughs> <laughs> oh, game over. <coughs> Excuse me, because I got captured twice, and then oh. one died, and then that was pretty much it. So right. there you go. It's your turn. Forty-nine point nine percent. That's not bad. That brought out my NES oh, nice. cartridge uh, version of it, which nice. is a pretty good Demons version. Demons of Death. Yeah, I said they probably nice. added that because they thought Galaga is not enough. Okay, I have to shoot this guy. There we go, and avoid the bullets. Yes, I do not want the bullets. <sighs> button. <laughs> it's good for games that you don't shoot a lot in. This is the game where you shoot a lot in. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, a, I, I definitely like this joystick better. For this? Yeah. Yeah. This is only Depends two Depends on what it is, but, uh, So it works really well. I feel like I need one of those TV trays, you know, the TV <laughs> dinner trays. <laughs> yeah. For this kind of joystick. It's heavy. Well, it's hard to balance on your lap, whereas you sort of want it right, right in front of you, so. That is true. Yeah. Those old fashioned 50 stuff. You know, Ooh, holding TV down the dinners. button really helps in this, actually. Well, you've also got two. Well, that helps too. Ooh, they don't thank shoot you for the you, help. You? No, this challenging stage. Do they in later oh, challenging thank stages? Thank you for the hint. Whoever said that hint of holding down the buttons? Uh, no, they, always, they never shoot in challenging stages because that's like a bonus stage. Avoid the bullets oh. and the, the, the kamikazes. Yeah. Kamikaze bugs. Yep, they are. They're bad. Oh, ah. They're bad bugs. Bad bugs. They do. And the hint I read online is don't stay in the corner. Oh, no. Because you can't get out of the No, corner. you get stuck because of the, the pattern of the... The bullets. Yeah. And they dive for you. Nice. I told them if I was going to get Stage a cabinet, five. this is would be the cabinet I would get. Oh, yeah. But we don't have room for a cabinet. <laughs> so we don't get a cabinet. <laughs> Someday, maybe. Yeah, if we get a bigger Someday. house, then that would be the game I would get. Yes. Or I'd built just a multi-arcade Yeah, that would be fun, too. Cabinet. I kind of like the multi-arcade cabinets where you can more just versatile. play. more versatile. I also really, really like the pinball ones, the digital pinball. Oh, digital cabinets, pinball, yeah. I would never buy just, an actual pinball. No, too no. Much oh, yeah. Well, it's also very hard um, 
keeping all those mechanical parts going. Yeah. But um, but I think it's really cool when they have the really really nice high definition digital ones, oh, and yeah. you can just pick a whole bunch of games to play. They were not cheap. They were like oh no, a couple thousand. No, I, well a lot of them were custom cabinets too. When you when you see them at Portland yeah. and places like and that. And licensed but, games uh, as well. Licensed games, yeah. So you're paying for that too. Yeah. But that's probably small in comparison yeah. to the TVs. The two I, TVs and the custom cabinet work and the cabinet art. Oh, Ooh. he 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 was three and then he became one. Yeah, and he came back. Usually he, he they don't back come back. One. Oh, the, the, the they three? They don't come back around. Oh, yeah. I didn't know that. So yet. that might be a bug as well. Possibly. Oh, they look so good. John has done such a fabulous job. Well, Nathan Strum did the uh, Nathan? artwork. Nathan? Oh, Nathan. Nathan Strum has done a fabulous who does, job. <laughs> who does all the great artwork on all the big games for John Champo and a lot of other people. But it just, just you know, even though... The movement. And the movement and the figures that they, you know, because obviously they can't have all the detail and the color when they're when they're moving. But the way they transition to sort of their their pause state at the top and yes. then and then change diving color. and they change color, I think it works oh, perfectly. And you don't even notice. No, they're, they're it works movement. perfectly. You don't care that they're not full color when they're moving around. Oh yeah, it looks really good. You just need to see the movement. Said that. Yeah, you should never say that out loud. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why you ever say that. Out I know loud. it's bad. Bad it's news. Very, to you. very bad. I'm going in stage nine with two extra lives. Nice. And fifty-four thousand. Yeah. There we go. Now we're back to normal. <laughs> Maybe this joystick is good. So Maybe. I guess post says three TVs or a real LED DMD. I don't know if that's in relation I don't know what a to DMD. That's probably for the. Um, the pinball. Oh, I see. Yes, three yes, LEDs? yes. Three LEDs? Uh, three TVs. Three, three TVs. I two. No, you need one. One for the flat. Oops. One for the... Ah. I can still get captured, though. Still having fun. Oh, You're still, still doing good. good. Oh, my God. <gasps> they went fast. Yeah, be that careful. That was really fast. Oh, my God. Let's start right away. Well, at least I don't have to worry about getting captured anymore. Just shoot everything. To reserve any of those Galagas. Nope! 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 Go away. Go away. Nope. Don't want it. Not buying it. Not buying it. Whatever you're selling. Sometimes it feels really unfair. It's like you <laughs> feel like you're hitting them, but you're not. Woohoohoo! Artful dodge. Oh, in there. good job! Level 10! I made it! Look at that symbol! Yeah. Oh yeah, the symbols are a little different because in the arcade, the symbols uh, were additive and they would use like, there's a five and a one and oh, a 10 yeah. symbol and they would add up, but that's too many, too many sprites. <laughs> too many sprites to handle. They'd be flickering constantly in the corner and it'd be yeah, very, you don't need that. very distracting. Ooh, they're going fast now. They are diving really fast. No! No, go away! No, no, no. That's how you end your game. Yes. Well, it would be. It'd be like, doo 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 and you're over. It's yeah. over. Okay. Come on. Yeah! Level 11! Oh, challenging! That's right, every four. I'm not gonna do so. And Whoa. then Dragonfly challenging! Oh, cool! I don't think I've ever seen this stage before in, in this Galaga or in or any arcade. other Galaga. I've, I've never made yeah. it to this far in the arcade, that's yeah. for sure. Oh my god, they didn't go to the center. Because <laughs> 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 I've never really played this, uh, other than the challenge mode that he uh, put into the game. I'm doing terrible. Well, because you don't know their patterns, that's no, the problem. <laughs> I don't know the patterns at all. Wow, good job. Slick shooting, Gretem says. Oh, Gretem's, welcome. Hello. Maybe Gretem's can't tune in during the day. I haven't Hello. seen her in a long time. Atari says hi. He's very, Atari very says impressed. Atari hi, Gretums. Yay! An extra life. Yay! <laughs> that was a bit of luck and a bit of skill. Mostly luck, though. And... I know. I, I was going to say, you do well with this joystick, but sometimes it's... Uh, Oh, that guy's... Oh, he turned back into a bee. I 
do have an extra guy to get captured, but I don't. I don't know if you want to risk it. Because if you die, and he's up there. Oh, you only have one to kill, so good luck with that. that. Yeah, so that might make it a little easier. Because I want it back immediately, please. Yeah. And I need to shoot him once, I think. <laughs> Ooh. Wait, that much. Yeah, okay, Atari. Get down. <laughs> You're fiddling too <laughs> he's, much. Get this out of the way. He's fluffing up your Galaga. He is. But I'm a big target now, and I know. the guys are it's moving goodness fast. It's good bad, you know? It is. gonna stay give them a wide area no. uh, oh, oh but you did really well level really 13 well. level 13 saw the galaxian in galaga yeah. oh, what is the galaxian is it the th oh in the um the bonus stage it was those those thick ships that were coming in um at, uh -huh. at one point Ooh, seven seven nine four oh Mm -hmm. That's Very actually nice. put zero page in. Very nice. Yeah, way better. Way above. But I only want to play with that joystick, actually. Okay. I that will let you painful. continue playing. I'm going to run away. Oh. <laughs> okay. Unless you want me to stay. Yes, please. Oh, okay. It makes it a lot easier. <sighs> obviously brought my Okay, I'm going to run away and get something to drink, and I'll, I'll be Okay. Back. First is Scorpion, sex is, second is Galaxian. Oh, okay. Oh, school and work kept me pretty, pretty busy. Oh, and congratulations, Gretams. I can say it in uh, person now. Good going for the thing you did. But I am going to employ this um, rapid fire because it did work really well because I had to imp I had to do it um, for the other joystick because the other joystick is a nightmare. Oops. Don't kill too many of those guys. As I need to get sucked up. There's the second guy. There we go. <clears throat> yeah, I think the key was rapid fire, but I don't know if rapid fire is a thing in the arcade, is it? I don't know. I don't think I ever even Do you even feel like you're that. cheating then if you're using rapid fire? If it's not in the arcade, I do feel like that. Uh, yeah, because I want to make sure that i You're a purist, I'm... a purist. Uh-huh. This, <laughs> this is supposed to be an arcade close, an arcade port, mm. for sure. I feel like. So do you know much about the history of this game and where the names for all these things came from? And no. Hmm, I'm curious about that. Because I couldn't prepare for the show. No, 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 that's fair enough. I, I wasn't sure because you're you're a Galaga fan that maybe maybe you knew a I little bit I wouldn't say it. fan. Yeah. I guess fan in, in terms of I like it a lot. Yeah. But not as in I'm very good at it or that I know a lot about it. I just like playing it a lot. Because somebody bitched me out in the forums saying it was embarrassing watching me play <laughs> being such a big fan of it um because i wasn't a great i wasn't great at, at playing it mm. arcade does not have rapid fire oh yeah. great i didn't think it did hey hey <laughs> so i need to wean myself off of rapid fire yeah i got a thousand points for killing myself <laughs> <sighs> start so should i not play with rapid fire is it rapid fire? oh with that but did the other joystick have rapid fire yeah it's built into the the machine oh it's built oh i see built, I see. In, built into the game built into the port you can turn it off with a hardware switch oh i see with the left and right difficulty oh. so that you don't accidentally do it um so i'm not going to use it because I don't want to do something that's not in the arcade. But it is an option for people who don't want to press the button a million times. Make a lot of noise or, I don't know, injure their finger. <laughs> or if they're using a, that XJ90 terrible joystick. A good joystick for some things. I really do like it, but 
Not for this game. It is not what you want to use. It's good for... Precision games? <coughs> yeah. Oh, precision games and also not for firing games. Not for anything that needs rapid fire. Just firing once. No! Oh well. Why? It won't, it won't, oh, it, it has to be the first one? Second one. That no, oh. was the second one. Oh, so. really? Oh, see, I don't know these patterns. Yeah. More often than not, spamming the button is faster. Okay. Oh, you come back. Oh, okay, so it wasn't the second one. It, you do get another chance. But it's not the first one, at least. And he also didn't get to do it. He didn't get a chance to uh, capture me. So I may have not missed that opportunity. There we go. Just in time, but I have no lives left. But they did keep the look of the level 5 symbol on mm. the bottom right corner. Yeah, and the yeah. level 10 symbol. Mm. So that's totally fine. There has to be con some concessions made. Well, of course. But you don't want to make the concessions in the gameplay. No. You want to make them in those kind of things. Yeah. Oh, the cat's crying, as he used to do in a random area of the house. There's no more guys to cap get captured. Yay! It's only a thousand for those guys? Hmm. And also... Is it me, or does it feel like the enemies don't go down low enough and then come back up at you? You know, in the arcade, they kind of loop around and come up behind you. A oh, they bit. loop. They they loop back around. Yeah, they're just going down. They're not looping back. Yeah, I feel that that's not happening. But I'll have I to thought I saw that happen with some, well, at least one of them. Yeah, they go down yeah. a little bit. No, no, no. No, no. Oh, that was close. Oh, yeah, it was. Didn't have much room there. Oh. oh, level six, terrible. Champ is reusing Scramble's level icon. Okay. Uh, do you want to play? Or? Sure. Okay. I'll play around. Um, do you want to try it on the easy mode, mm -mm. where you start with two? Mm -mm. Oh, okay. I'm going to turn off the rapid That timer. is cheating. <laughs> oh, you're going to turn it off? Yeah. I don't so think I, I was using it anyway. So, so I don't accidentally use it. Yeah. Purist. Looping in advance and with the scorpions. Oh. Looping's in the advanced mode? It's in the advanced mode. Mm. We should play the advanced mode then. You want to switch it to the advanced mode? Uh, well, yeah, we can start it over. Okay. Right. There you go. Is advanced. Is advanced considered the arcade version? Uh, I suppose says that's that's when I saw it. Oh, okay. Oh, they're shooting right off the bat and dive I think that's me. what happens in the arcade. Is it? Like it's it's harder right okay. away. Okay. Well, that's fair. Mm -hmm. Let me look up the notes that John sent me about the game again. About the advanced mode. Yeah, player starts with one ship and two in reserve. Enemy move. Enemies move faster. Enemy missiles are faster. Where enemies take off more frequently. Extra ships are added during the fly-in sequence. So I think this is more like the arcade. So this is the one we really should be playing on. I don't see any looping yet. Like coming down and no, I'm not oh, seeing I love that. the stars go crazy uh, when yeah. you're captured. Yeah, yeah. That's nice. Is there parallax in the arcade of the stars or not? Because they all are moving at the same pace here. Obviously, that's what's going to happen because it's very hard to do uh, parallax with the. Oh no, he's gone. Yeah, you have to shoot him. Oh, it's a bug. It's a bug in the game. No. It's the one big bug, unfortunately. It's a pretty big bug. It is a big bug. Oh, man. You get one chance. Oh, I... 
Ah! <laughs> that was pretty very tough. Good. Pretty tough on the advanced. Yeah, definitely. More like the more like the arcade game, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, look at that kitty in the corner Ooh. there. He's hiding from view. <laughs> Let's see how I do fair here. Is this still on advanced? Yeah. Yeah, because they're they're shooting and looping, or shooting and coming down, dive bombing. Bugs and the bees. Yeah, the bumblebees. I was trying to look on the Wikipedia page to get a oh, sense God. of the inspiration of where all all the. Yeah. No, there's nothing from there. So. Uh, yeah, yeah, sometimes Wikipedia is, is full of things, but it depends on who put it in and how much they want to put. Well, in. no, there wasn't. I mean, just more the inspiration for the the look and the. Well. The sort yeah. of enemy spaceships as bugs and all of that. I'd be kind of curious as. I mean, the what motivated the designer. The gameplay is from Galaxian. But, yes, yeah, from but Galaxian. the look, I think, was redesigned for Galaga. So there would have been a change mm. from that to this game. So there, I don't think there's any bees in Galaxian. Unless I'm mistaken. Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh, no! Might as well shoot myself now. Well, you do get a thousand wait. points, so. Yeah, yeah. For shooting yourself. It is a few points. It's not yeah. enough. Not enough, <laughs> to but make, it is. To make up for it. Well. Oh. oh my god. It's a lot harder. Yeah. Space Invaders, Galaxy, and Galaga. Yes. Yeah. And then GA, plus, and then Galaga 88. And then a bunch of other ones that I'm not aware of the progression. Yeah, quite a few versions. The blue ones loop back, I suppose to say. I didn't, oh, I didn't, okay. yeah, I have to I keep my eyes again. peeled for that. No parallax in the arcade version, I just loaded in MAME to check. Okay, so all the stars go down at the same rate. Okay. Oh my god, oh. right off the bat, I, I want to restart. restart that. That is bad. <laughs> so in the next uh, version, uh, John Chapo says there will be uh, save key support for saving high scores, the high score tables. Oh my goodness, oh, I'm just not wow. moving out of the way fast enough. Yeah, I, it is a lot faster than the uh, the act, um, the normal version. Yeah, this is better. This is more like the arcade because I was looking at some arcade um, footage. And then I, w I was thinking back to playing this game earlier today. Oh, goodness. And they're moving a lot slower in the standard. And this is more the speed of the arcade. There's the blue one. Yes, oh, he it is does looping loop back. back. Yes, you were right. Yeah. I supposed to. But I remember it looping back onto the screen, if you know what I mean. Like when you, you play did. the game. You did. No, but he went back to his starting position. I, I, my memory is oh, of... He does. Yeah. Is, is of them, them, um... No. No, <laughs> oh, you're trapped. Shoot him. Oh, 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 that was terrible. No, 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 no. That was terrible. <laughs> I need to make to it go to level again. two, at least. <laughs> yeah, no, that was, that was terrible. I told him I felt it was my obligation to play this game. And I want to play it too. Um, because nobody else has this in the world except for John Champo, Nathan Strum, <laughs> and myself. So. You feel special. It's, well, <laughs> special, but, but also if I don't play it, nobody will be able to see it. Not yet. Not yet. I mean, I mean they can watch my gameplay from earlier today, but. Like, I wanted to explore more about the game and, and get better at it, too. Yay! <laughs> <coughs> Stressful. Yes. Lord Monka says, yes, there are different loop patterns. Yes. Yeah, yeah they kind of loop backwards sometimes. Mm. I haven't seen that happen here, but... Shoot it! Oh, oh, it's gone. 
It'll come back the next level. <laughs> It'll come back the next level? Yep. After everything's formed at the top, he'll appear at the top. Again. Really? Captured, yep. Oh, that's weird. It certainly is. And I'm trying to think of when that would happen in a normal game without the bug. What was that noise for? Oh, 10,000. 10,000. You, do, you don't get extra lives or anything, no, which I think, I think is entirely make, unfair. I think it just makes that noise every 10,000. I mean, for it's no nice. Reason. I like it's it. Nice. Kind of gives you a... Oh, your ship didn't come back. No! What is happening with these ships? Did you shoot it accidentally? <gasps> Maybe. No, I, I, don't, I didn't shoot it. <laughs> I don't recall shooting it. No, I don't either. I didn't see it, though, either. You might have accidentally... You don't want to be captured? No? No, I only You're have two. You're good, <sighs> oh. oh, that was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> Stay in the... Yeah. Usually the center for this is... Yeah. For this first challenging Not speech. exactly in the center, though. No, a little bit off. It's a little bit off. Oh, 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 terrible. At least I made it more than stage one, though. That's, that's yes. my goal. I'm like, well, I passed stage one, so that was better. Oh, almost. Oh, I uh, should have kept shooting. I can see why you might play it novice, so you can, you can, you can actually, you actually, ah, I went right into him. You can actually get a chance to play the higher levels and see the yes, patterns. Yes, yeah. Because it's hard to kind of know where What's to happening. be and... Yep. Yay, extra life. Oh, thank goodness. Good job. How did I get an extra life? 20,000. Ah, oh, do you get it every 20,000 or just the first 20,000? My tablet stole it. I don't think it's every 20,000. Oh. I think it has to, it has, goes up from there. I think it's just being nice at 20,000. Let's see. Oh, he came back up. He did loop back. Oh, and then I died. <laughs> uh. <coughs> no, he looped back up from the from the bottom. Oh, the, the bee like did. Down? Yeah. Oh, the bee. The bee looped back up from the bottom. Very nice. Oh, you can look for how when extra lives are. I don't think I couldn't find uh, life or extra lives. Extra lives, twenty thousand, seventy thousand, every multiple of seventy. Oh, you made it. I'm just gonna be Z ZPH because it doesn't store it. No. For now. It doesn't use the save key yet. Oh. Good job. Woo. I have to beat that. <laughs> On the advanced, I'm sure you will. Mm. It's pretty hard. Twenty and then seventy. Twenty, seventy, and every seventy. 70, okay. Wow. Oh, and then at, once you hit a million points, if you're so lucky, uh, no, <laughs> more, no more extra lives after that. A million. Well, if you made it to a million, then you're pretty damn good. And you should be saving your lives. Interesting. So, Galaga... The second player may have up to eight digit scores. Yes. First video arcade game to have the feature. Oh. Um, however, the high score the display hell? maxes out at six digits. So if you get an eight digit score, it won't show up in the For high player score. player one. Oh, the, the high score. High score oh. doesn't show more than six. So you have to six. see it happen live. Yeah. And just kind of remember that you looped it. Yeah. Yeah, because I was watching a really good player, and I think he got up to, like, oh. six million. Oh, that's crazy. But the funny thing is, he so. played player one first, mm -hmm. and he got up to the max score you can get on player one, oh. which was 999,950 mm -hmm. or something, and then he died on purpose, and then he went to player two and got to six million. Really? <laughs> so that was really funny. Wow. It's like it was his practice run. It's a pa yeah, well, hey, whatever works. See, he looped oh, back. Oh, yeah, he looped way back. But but he sometimes they loop back and loop back to their starting position. Like at the top? But the one but one of them did actually go down and loop back and back down. So they mm. do have different movement, which is very, very cool. That makes very it Very cool, yeah. Die. Die. 
Yay! Makes it a challenge, an extra, <laughs> extra added challenge <laughs> that you have to kill that ship on the first loop here. Biggest challenge is keeping your two ships with all the bullets, bullets and raining dive bombers. Down. And yeah, that's for sure. Oh, oh, he went right. He that he was sneaky. That was a comic because he looked like he was he was going with the pack, and then he just went boom right into you. Diverted off. Yeah. Yep. But I saw online this is is more applicable here than because I was playing it on the other version and it wasn't working the the um, tactic I was using. Um. Where you kind of draw their fire and then move out of the way of their fire. Mm. Like you start in a corner and then move out of the corner after they start firing. Okay. Challenging stage. Ooh, just in front. Nope. If you know the patterns, it's not so bad. Mm. So you have to memorize the patterns. That, that's what really helps. Yay! Yay! Stay in the corner and then move out of the corner. Like that. That didn't help at all. <laughs> Neither did that. That's kind of the thing. You stay in a position till they fire, then move out of the way of the bullets. I love the scorpions. Oh, they're great. <laughs> so good. Cute little things. <laughs> Excuse me. But I think the thing is just make sure you have room to keep moving. Don't... Yeah. Make you get yourself cornered where you don't have enough room to move over when they dive bomb you. Because they move just as fast horizontally as you do. At least when they come in. Um, while they're filling the screen up. Not many lives, but understanding it better. Mm. Yeah, because in the, the one where the guy was playing, he was just shifting over just a little bit when when he was uh, taking care of the guys when they come in. Mm. Like he would wait and then oh. uh, shift over just a little bit. Yeah. It's like a dodge tactic almost. Yeah, but very very little movement mm. in his dodge dodging. Like I completely forget that I'm playing an Atari Twenty Six Hundred and I'm just yeah. playing Galaga. Oh my god! Yeah, I I it it it's it's looks great. Ah! That's how you lose two lives all at once. Yeah, that was good though. Mm -hmm. You beat me. I think I was at twenty eight and you you were over three. I think thirty nine. 39. Excellent. Almost four. I wonder if anybody ever cares about that ratio. Because <laughs> it doesn't seem to apply to any of the high scores. You gonna play again? No. Or, I'm okay. gonna run upstairs and do something. Nope. So. Let me play one more game. Okay. <laughs> then we'll sign off. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to I didn't mean to rush you. <laughs> no 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 no. I, I think I'm I have a few maxed out at, at what I wanted to do. Okay. Oh, actually, we'll, I, I want to show you the challenging stage. Oh, okay. Because you didn't see that. The challenging stage? So it's just the challenging? Just the challenging stage. Really? Stages. So you can kind of practice on them. But it's in a game It's a game in itself. Mm. Because you start with one... You're doing terrible there. You start with one uh, ship. Okay. Which is hard to do a challenging stage with yes, one ship. Yes, true. If you shoot all 40 of the yeah. ships that come in, yeah. you get... 
you get the double ship for, okay. the, for the next challenge. Ah, stage. oh my goodness. That's got to be challenging on this, though, because I do yeah, find okay. your shots are a little slow, maybe? Maybe not. I don't know. Do you, do you think your shots are slower than, than in the arcade version? No? Normal. It's just me, then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think they're pretty normal. Yeah. Um, and if you don't shoot all 40, you lose a life. Oh, so you're just dead? Yeah. You, no, you lose. You have three lives? Two lives? Oh, you still have three lives. Yeah. Oh, okay. Mm. Mm. So annoying. So annoying. The game is going to get easier when that part is fixed. Mm. Oh, anyway, go to challenging stage and I'll show you that. Okay. Do I get to play? Yep. Okay. All right. So. So you have to shoot all 40 or you die. Okay. If you do <laughs> shoot all 40, you get double ship, which makes the next one a lot easier. Nope. Nope. You will <laughs> die at the end of this. Oh my goodness. This is not going to go over well. <laughs> this is when you need... See, this is... I can't, I can't shoot fast enough. Only two bullets come out fat at a time. So I know! It's terrible! But that's maximum. You get it back when you kill something, though, immediately. But this gives you good practice on the patterns. Terrible. Nope. And dead. Watch this. Oh, this will be so you can see the explosion, actually. <laughs> that's a really good explosion. I like it. Yeah. <laughs> Reminds me is of the Draconian the explosion. No, it's the next challenging stage. It's challenging stage two. So it's different. It's a different. So it's even harder. Yes. <laughs> oh, geez, that's not good. It's even harder. I don't know how you get all these. I just don't understand. It's possible. <laughs> it's Someone hard. does. It's hard as hell, but it's possible. You probably have to hit things absolutely perfectly. See? <laughs> <laughs> there you go. One left. Oh, two left. Oh, one. Oh. Just missed one. Sorry, my nose is <laughs> itchy. itchy? <laughs> I knew I was dead. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> all right. <laughs> this is the one with the dragonflies. Cool. They come in and out on the same spot. I don't know how you would get those. It's too many. It's a lot. Too many. I guess you just get used to the patterns. You do. You know when that when that where they're coming in, and where they're exiting, and you just shoot for that, and you will get them. <sighs> Terrible. It's cool though. I'll play this one and then we'll go. Okay. Just you do don't have thing. to go. No, I, I'm I'm done. Have you done your your? max of what you wanted to I th do? I think so. I did pretty good on the advanced. Oh, you got on the scoreboard. Hmm? It doesn't say though, you were saying. Not yet. Okay. Oh. I should have been on the right hand side or something. This comes in here. And then you have to move over to that. This comes in on that. That's how you do that. This comes in on that. Just gotta watch some expert players and pick up some tactics. That was good. <laughs> that was good. That was good. Pick off the last one. Not bad. 30 out of 40. Boom. Where'd they come in here? Top left. They're in twos. See, Hard, they're not there long enough. And those guys take two shots. I know, terrible. That's not impossible, that one. No. It's just when they leave the screen really quickly. Like those ones come down and they're gone. Oh, see that? Oh, oh so close. Oh, <laughs> so close. I think I did better. 33 out of 40. Very good. Still explode. You're just gonna go. Now these guys come in left and right mm -hmm. on the top. Mm-hmm. Down the center. 
And then they split up, I think. Or not down the center. Down the left and then to the and right. And then to the right, I think. Oh, oh no. no, they don't. Plus, they have those Galagas. Is that what they are? Galagas? Yeah. They're the boss of these. Oh, <sighs> anyone still watching out there? They're quiet. Yeah. They're just watching. Those and Buddhists went to bed. <laughs> he did. Yeah. The music is, is lovely, though. I just love the Real sound good. of Galaga. Yeah. And he, and he got that echo. That echoey. <laughs> really <laughs> good. It's using both the, both the channels. Both the voice channels. Mm. Playing one. Do, 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 mm. do, 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 right one after the other. Good stuff. That's a really good job. So... Oh, I score knocked you out. <gasps> got 25. You got 15. I, think. I don't know. It wasn't much. <laughs> Whatever it was. Good job. All right. So, oh, there we go. Galaga. So thanks for tuning in, everybody, for this late night broadcast. It, it's uh, very inconvenient for people on the East Coast and very inconvenient uh, for people in Europe. <laughs> so, and that's why there's nobody watching. Well, that's okay. Um, but I thought I it's for me. I wanted to play this again and just play a little bit more of it. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah, and it's practice up on it. Cause beautiful I, port to Atari of Galaga. Oh, my God. Well, it's, it's the only amazing. one. amazing. As well, because it was too hard. Yeah. Thanks for the demo of Galaga. You're very uh, welcome, yep. Lord Mungus. And thanks for, thanks for tuning in. <laughs> yeah, thanks for tuning uh, in and staying up with us. Yeah. Um, I'm glad I could make it for the last little bit. Yeah, because you didn't get to play it much when we were doing the initial stream. No, well, yeah, I, I, I stepped in when Erlen, Erlen was playing and then jumped in for a few minutes. So. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's very, very fun. Oh, noises are still happening in the background. Um. Yeah, and I'm really uh, fortunate to um, be able to play this. Mm -hmm. um, so I wanted to play it for everyone out there. And um, we'll definitely be playing this again in the 12-hour uh, broadcast yes, as absolutely. well. absolutely. Probably yeah. with an updated version, Yeah, I would think, mm -hmm. um, without that bug <laughs> where your, your extra guy disappears and it's difficult to get him back. Um, and probably with the save key, uh, enabled as well. Cause he said he was going to take out that, uh, passcode. Actually, you didn't see that. Did you I'll show you that? That's funny. The what? Because you didn't see us load it. No. No. <laughs> Watch this. There's a passcode. Yeah. So he sent this to us, Game right? Secret project. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. And he was going to give me the password in the stream. Okay. So I couldn't load it early. Okay. Right? And see if he recognized what, uh, recognized this. Oh, blank down. Sorry for everyone out there. There we go. Recognize where that's from? No, but, well, I, I'm not. <sighs> Is that, um, uh, um, War Games? Yes. Okay. Yeah. I'm like, I know I'm going to get the reference somewhere. So it's the computer. Asking yeah. if you'd like, Matthew would you Broderick like to play would like to play a game. Yeah. He's like, yes. Global Thermonuclear War, please. Yeah. <laughs> so he gave me the password and he, he said, oh, it's ZPH. And then he's like, then I put, typed it in and, and it wasn't. <laughs> it's actually Z80, which is a, uh, nice. a computer chip, a very popular computer chip. Gotcha. Very nice. Yeah. Very nice. So I have to punch Very that in every nice. time. Oh, Lord yeah, Monk has Lord got Monk it. Lord Monk has got it. It yeah. took me a second. I'm like, oh, what is it? I'm like picturing Matthew Broderick having flashbacks to Ferris Bueller's Day <laughs> Off. I'm like, no, that's not the one. Yeah. But yeah. Oh, Excellent. I supposed to. Which second bug did you find in the stream? Uh, I supposed to. Filed a bug with Galaga. Caught one more in the second stream. Oh. Good. Yeah, the more bugs we find, the better. The it better will it'll be. be. Yeah. So I thought I found something, but now I can't remember what it was. Um, I yeah. yeah, maybe. Um, I'm sure John will watch this this stream. Yeah. Of, of uh, somebody other than Nathan Strum playing the game. <laughs> 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 yes. Uh, captured ship didn't reappear. Yeah. 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 That's a big one. Oh yeah, when you were playing, it just never came back. No, it didn't. It didn't come back in the next screen. round. No. Yeah. No, that's Leave okay. him alone. He's sleeping. Oh, the cats are getting rowdy. 
So, uh, anyway, thanks for tuning in, everybody. Uh, Sir Cat Legs, who did the audio oh, and, and the music. Oh, very cool. Yep. Very, very good. Very good. Very yeah. good. He did that in 2012. Really? All this. Just, <laughs> wow. there wasn't a Galaga game, and he just thought, just, I'm going to make I, all I the music. I want to do the music. Yep. Oh, that's very cool. Um, yeah. And I remember running across that. It's like, oh, yeah, we're so close. Somebody just needs to make the game now. <laughs> no. No. There's a lot more to it. Yeah. And, and, uh. John Champeau made a DOS version of Galaga. Oh, okay. So he ported some code over to the Atari. Okay, anyway, we're going to sign off. Yeah. It's getting hot in here because uh, the window's closed and the lights are on and it's hot. Oh, well, it's 24 <laughs> degrees. Um, thanks. Oh, 2013. Oh, I can't remember. Yeah. <laughs> but it was, it was close. It was close. <laughs> um, so we will see you on um, Friday at uh, mm. noon. Pacific, 3 p.m. Eastern. In, in town, right? Yeah, yep. 8 p.m. Uh, GMT, and Darcy will be in town. And we have two uh, games to premiere as well then. Very exciting. That is exciting. But lots you can of check. Premiere games coming up. Yeah, lots of yeah. programming happening. Yeah. Um, but you guys can check that out in the Atari Age forums under my thread. Just search for Zero Page Homebrew in the forums. And uh, good night, Gretams. Good night, Lord Mungus. Good night, yep. Sir Catlegs. Good, good night, night Ice Bosta. Um, and everybody else who is lurking, um, we will see you on Friday. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs>